Life in Jean Sizes is the name of the poem. Size 7. The first time somebody ever called me fat was on an elementary school playground. I wish I could tell you I slapped the crooked tooth grin off of her fourth grade face that no one else ever dared tease me. But my hands remained calm at my sides, daring only to wipe my tears when she turned her back. My chameleon heart wanted to burn bright, to surround myself in vibrant courage, but instead, it faded into the colors behind me. This will not be the last time I feel invisible. Size nine, my mother encourages me to join Weight Watchers, but they refuse to let me in. Say I'm too young, that I'll grow into my body, but as I got older, my body began to grow into me. My stretch marks wove their way into my soul. Um, until finally they found themselves wrapped around my neck. My skin became more of a prison than a home. I began to feel fat on the inside more than I did on the outside. Size 13, my mother whispers quietly to me in a dressing room as we stand in front of its unforgiving mirror that she will never buy a pair of jeans in a size bigger than this. I shake my head, promise her she won't have to, but I keep promises the same way I love myself. She does this out of love. I just can't remember when love started to feel the same as disappointment. Size 16, I fell in love with a boy who kept me a secret. His compliments took up space where love for myself should have been. I taught myself to find comfort in shadows until darkness felt like home. I still don't like to leave the lights on when he left me for a girl whose only curve was her smile. I taught myself ways to compare my type of beautiful to hers, but I forgot that beauty is not proportionate. Size 18, my friends still don't know I have an eating disorder. Still go to therapy in secret while coaches make up excuses for me they still don't know. And maybe it's just because I don't want their sympathy. Or maybe it's because I'm afraid they'll think I'm just begging for attention like I chose this. Size 18, maybe it would be good for me to tell someone that mirrors make me anxious. That before FaceTiming I rehearse my camera angles to make sure none of them are unflattering. Size 18, that every time I go to the doctor I still ask the nurse not to read my weight out loud. Size 18, every time I take a shower I count my stretch marks in the mirror and I still have 73 to 76 reasons to hate myself depending on the lighting. Size 18, I am still learning to love myself. Yesterday, I cut the tags out of all my jeans, and today, I smiled at my reflection.